Terrebonne looks to stay unbeaten as Hanville head coach Nick Saltafamaggio returns to the sidelines. Plus, Jesuit and Holy Cross approach nearly a century of football matchups. And Thibodeau faces a tough test going on the road at Destrehan. That and much more tonight on 4th Down Friday. From Channel 4, this is 4th Down Friday, presented by your Southern Quality Ford dealers. We begin tonight at Breeze Family Field, Lusher and Newman, and this will be the theme of the night, the return game. Newman's Murray Calhoun fields it, and he will not be touched. 80-yard kick return for a touch on the opening kickoff. Good start for the Greenies. They're up 7-0. The scoring would continue in the first quarter for Newman. March, Martin Butcher under center. He hooks up with Murray Calhoun as he escapes the pressure and finds him. 25-yard score. 14-0 Newman after one. Second quarter, Butcher and Calhoun hook up for the second time in the first half. This one, a 38-yard connection for the touchdown. A 21-0 Newman advantage. T.J. Bush had three rushing touchdowns in the first half as Newman improves the 5-0, blowing out Lusher tonight, 52-0. And after tonight, we'll be through the halfway point of the prep football regular season. What up? Welcome to Fourth Down Friday. I'm Ricardo LeCompte. We've got teams at this point wanting to show they are for real, like in tonight's game of the week. Terrebonne is off to a 4-0 start and can prove it belongs among the metro area's elite with a win over Hanville tonight. The Tigers embroiled in drama to start the year, but they did get their head coach back from a four-game suspension. This game in Thibodeau tonight due to poor field conditions at Terrebonne High in Homa. Andrew Doak joins us live from Thibodeau's Tiger Stadium with more on tonight's game. Hey, Andrew. Yeah, hey, Ricardo. And, and really, this storyline, as far as Hanville is concerned, with Nick Salter-Formaggio coming back after his four-game suspension, it really took a back seat based on how this game played out. And I'm going to tell you something right now. If you haven't watched Terrebonne this season, you're missing out. They're a fun team to watch. Defensively, they're salty. And offensively, they have a three-headed monster between Ja'Kai Douglas, Chaz Ward, and Keyshawn James that's electric to watch. And all three of them were involved in every touchdown they scored tonight. Hanville and Terrebonne both looking for their first win in district play and Hanville head coach Nick Salta Formaggio back on the sideline after serving a four game suspension. Lots of running in this one because of the conditions scoreless into the second quarter. This 14 yard run from Terrebonne's Keyshawn James has the Tigers knocking on the door of the red zone. But later in the drive, Terrebonne indecisive with the handoff and it's on the carpet. Hanville's number 93, Brady Compo recovers. So Hanville trying to get something started but then they're stopped at the Terrebonne 37 yard line on this fourth and short. So Terrebonne starts tracking third and four from the Hanville 17. Keyshawn James puts his foot in the ground to pick up seven. Drive continues. Later in the drive, third and goal from the 11 after a hold backed up Terrebonne even more, but it wouldn't matter. James finds Ja'Kai Douglas on the corner route. It's seven to nothing Terrebonne, and they would take that score into the half. Start of the second half, Terrebonne gifted great field position near midfield after they recover an onside kick. They take advantage. Chaz Ward finds a crease, and he's got reservations for six. 13-0 Terrebonne after the missed PAT. Hanville on the move, though, after Terrebonne couldn't get a punt off. But Drew Nockwin is robbed. Number 15, Trinity Stewart with the INT, and they're in business. On the other side, Chaz Ward running like a bull, and he gives them the horns. 19-0 Terrebonne. Ensuing drive for Hanville. This time, Nockwin coughs it up. Number 19, Blake Lopez recovers, and Terrebonne smells blood. Next drive, give him another dose of Ward. 32 yards to pay dirt, and it's 26 0 Terrebonne. Following drive, it's Blake Lopez with another turnover. That's three straight turnovers for Hanville. Lopez gets the turnover chain as Terrebonne tramples Hanville 41 0 in Thibodeau. We, work, we just work as a team. At practice, communicate with each other. And, uh, if, if we need help with something, we just ask each other. The best thing about them, besides being great athletes, is they're really great kids. Uh, you know, they're fun to coach, they work their tails off, they get along with each other, they're not selfish, they support each other. And when you got three kids like that, it just makes our job a lot easier. Now, speaking of Ja'Kai Douglas, he scored two other touchdowns we weren't able to show you tonight. He's ranked the 14th best player, according to 24-7 Sports. Guess what gloves he was wearing tonight? LSU said it was just showing love. 
All right, here in Thibodeau, Andrew Doak for Fourth Down Friday. Good stuff, Andrew. Thank you very much. Let's head over to Pan Am Stadium tonight. Riverside and De La Salle. Both teams have combined one and five coming into this one, but both teams better than those records. Third quarter, Rebels trail 24-14. Gage Lavardian. The dart over the middle, the receiver Jalen Watkins. They hook up for the touchdown. Riverside now down 24-21. Next De La Salle possession. Montrell Johnson hits the hole, and he's throwing up the deuces. 75 yards scamper to the end zone, and just like that, the Cavaliers are back up by 10. Johnson not done just yet. Later in the third quarter, takes the handoff, breaks the tackle off the line, and he's going in for a 35-yard touchdown. De La Salle goes on to win big, 45 28. The oldest rivalry in Louisiana and the fifth oldest in the country, Holy Cross and Jesuit have played every year since 1922. And tonight the Tigers and Blue Jays hook up for the 99th time. Bragging rights as well as a 2-0 start in Catholic League play on the line. Jesuit leads the all-time series 56-40 and one, but throw out the records when the rivals hook up. Tad Gormley the site for this year's rivalry game. Low scoring first half, two field goals by the Jays. And then, like I said, that theme, Look the return this. game. Start of the second it's half, Besh. Luke Besh fields it, and he's taking this back to the crib. 93-yard kick return for a touchdown. Jesuit takes a 13-0 lead. More Jays in the third. Brayton Whittington breaks off a huge wow. run, nearly scores, gets tackled down at the one. 30-yard pickup. Whittington would score got on the it, next play it, to make it 20 to nothing. Now this Holy Cross defense only given up 13 points through the first four games. The D finally getting something to go their way later in the third. Holy Cross able to force the fumble. And Elias Brown scoops it up, giving the Tigers back the rock. Then the Tigers decide to run Philly Philly. Remember the Philly special? Well, this ends up in the hands as Jelly Johnson heaves it to Brent uh, to Brian Broussard for the eight-yard touchdown. Tigers finally on the board, trailing 20 to 7, but Jesuit too strong down the stretch. Willie Robinson will not be denied. 15-yard touchdown rumble. Jesuit wins the 99th edition of this rivalry, handing Holy Cross his first loss of the year, 28 to 7. 16 and counting for Edna Carr, standing in the way of 17 tonight, the Kennedy Carr Cougars. Carr scores quickly. Ronnie Jackson gives the Cougars an early seven zip lead on this seven yard touchdown run. Carr continuing to tally the points. Ronnie Jackson again. This one for 22 yards out. Cougs in control, 14-0 after one. Second quarter, Ahmad Antoine says, dude, you can't be ho hogging all the spotlight. Let me get into the end zone. Eight-yard touchdown, there you go. Car dominates JFK, 17 consecutive victories, 56-0 the final. Coming up, we'll head to Destrahan, where the Wildcats took on an undermanned Thibodeau roster. We'll explain why. And would Higgins or West Jeff claim West Bank bragging rights? But first, some scores from around the metro area. 